Our father, Marine Lance Corporal Jared Schmitz, who was killed at the age of 20 at the Abbey Gate in Kabul, Afghanistan on August 26, 2021. I identify as a father, a husband, a pissed off, fed up American patriot, and now thanks to this administration, a gold star dad. At the age of three, Jared has always dreamed of being a Marine. Once he made it into his sophomore year of high school, he was hard set on becoming a Marine. He felt like he was finally getting the chance to make a difference. He felt by becoming a Marine, he would make that difference a reality. Jared meant you knew he always looked out for the little guy. He was the type of young man who looked out for everyone. After landing in Afghanistan, a few days went by before I heard from him. When he finally had a chance to call, he told me he was, he was at the Abbey Gate. He said he thought he was going to die there those first couple of days due to the absolute chaos. He said, Dad, the look on these people's faces was that of utter human desperation. And there's no way that we can save them all. He said he was exhausted and needed to get some rest before going back on the post. The next day, the explosion happened. The next day, my son... Someone's gone forever. He will never have the sun shine on his face again. He will never have the chance to get married. He will never experience the joy of being a father. Our family name died that day. Sure stole their lives, their futures, their dreams, and have ripped apart 13 families. I would venture a guess that you have more American blood on your hands, Mr. Biden, than any president in U.S. history. There couldn't be anything more disgusting and cowardly than the way you have treated us. You are a disgrace to this nation. I'm often asked what accountability looks like. Simply put, what is most important to me is that the history books are written accurately and honestly. Mr. Biden has run his entire political campaign for 50 years as the family man. Well, I've got news for you, sir. The curtain has been lifting, and that campaign slogan will never work again.